Hey guys, this is Diddy Witch one here on Jimmy Master Metronics, and I apologize for the sound outside, but it is raining, and that is the gutter. But this is the, I believe, 2002 Whitley store display. So, this is the store display model of the Whitley figure, the ultimate interactive animated learning toy. So, a few of these store displays have popped up here and there for the Yeno figure, which is very similar to this, but not really that many of the Whitley one. When I got the Derpy Butler, and this guy had this in his garage and he sold it to me for 10 bucks. I've always really enjoyed store displays, especially the plexiglass ones like the Legos and everything, so I'm really glad to own this. And the interesting thing about this is that now it has two like boards. So it has the programming for the store display model, but if you stick your finger in there you can actually play the little game on him. If you stick your finger through that hole, you can press the buttons and play the game. So then it's just like he's got the normal programming in him. So it's really like he has two programmings in him, which is really neat. And then there's the little pad here, and when he talks about things, like if he says colors and shapes, and a bunch of shapes will appear on that, it's all really sophisticated. And the animation is really advanced for the time as well. It's really good. And sadly, the mouth has recently quit on it. It'll work on and off, so if the mouth doesn't move, I apologize, but everything else works flawlessly. So now I'll look at the details. So it says, Hi, I'm Whitley, the ultimate interactive animated learning toy. We can play games and do activities while you have fun learning. The three activity art cards, including the alphabet, numbers, colors, and shapes. From activity touchpad lets you interact with me, which is that thing. And here he is. He's in great shape. There's a little bit of fur down there, but that's fine. Um, this corner still needs to be cleaned a little bit more. This was covered in dust and stuff like crazy when I first got it, in like dirt, but I cleaned most of that off. Just a little corner. It's a little bit rough. So what happens is he's here. Maybe he'll make a few sounds every once in a while, but you press this and it does the activation, which is what I will say is very long. But then, if, And this is heavy, by the way, because I know that Another member of this channel, Joseph, was wanting this, but I was telling him the shipping will be a ton because this thing weighs a lot. But they were smart. They put a barcode on here so people could actually buy these. I'm like, this thing must be thrown out or else. And you must destroy it before you throw it away. Like the Lego things, because it says that on the bottom. But then, so it says number 31,200. I'm sure that's not for store displays. I'm guessing that's how many of Whitley's there were. But it's like they just stuck a Whitley barcode on here, and they just count this as a produced model. So it says 2002, the original San Francisco Toy Makers Inc., all rights reserved. And there's actual little off and on switch. And so you're probably wondering, well, this is pretty advanced and it's heavy. So how does it run? You plug it in. That's a big N-O. This is about the biggest battery cover I've ever seen. Sorry, it's so out of focus, but hey, there's me. Yes, this is the battery cover, guys. It's huge. So yeah, now I'm going to flip it back over. It's hard to do from this angle, but yeah. So once I turn the switch on, he'll do the pro activation once. Then I'll show you how you can do the little game here, and then if you were to press the button again, he would do it again. So yeah, let's turn him on. Okay, sorry about that. Bailey just walked in the room during the review and it scared me. I wasn't sure who it was. <laughs> Can't wait to go back and wash up. <laughs> yes, now we're turning it on for you. Because you learn and grow from my games. 
And the games I play aren't mind-numbing video games. They're all educational. Learn about the alphabet, vocabulary, phonics, numbers, counting, adding and subtracting, colors and shapes, body parts, time, cognitive memory games like Simon. And they're all games we play together. Here's how I work. You slide an activity card into my activity pad and we play games associated with that activity. There's even a screen on my activity pad that has pictures and everything. When you slide the alphabet card in, we can play games to learn letters, how they sound, how to put them together to form words, and even go on an alphabet adventure. There are also activity cards for numbers, colors and shapes. body parts, and all sorts of other things. Even the buttons light up to play games with lights and colors. Oh! Children will never get tired of playing with me. So let's get ready to rock and roll! We are going to boogie woogie to the beat because Whitley's in town! I am Whitley. Bye bye! So yeah, that's pretty long activation, and you may, you notice, of course, the mouse started to work and stopped working a few times. It's either a loose connection, but it's sort of noisy, so it could also be a, just probably a split gear. It shouldn't be too bad, but yeah. It's crazy how, for 2002, as a toy, this thing's so advanced, and it does so much. And it's really cool how, as its own little programming coming out of that speaker, and then the little screen corresponds to what he's saying, and just all really interesting stuff. So I believe if I just start pushing this, I can play the game. No, wait, I gotta turn them on. Hey, dude, what do you say? I'm Whitley. Okay, there we go. Hey, why don't you select an activity card and we'll get busy? So now this is his normal programming. Awesome! I dig playing right memory games. Let's get busy! Sort of hard to reach sometimes. Thankfully, I have long fingers. See, so yeah, I was just going to show you the different colors and stuff, but let me just go ahead and switch them off since he's... We'll just reset him. So yeah, that's what he does. It's really neat how he also has the original programming for the produced model, so if you have long fingers, you can actually stick your fingers through this little slot and you can actually play the little game on him. But yeah, that's about all he does, so... I hope you enjoyed this review and I'll see you next time.